Killed in action in 1944, a 26-year-old World War II soldier's remains went unidentified for years. It was until last year when historians put together some missing pieces, later learning it belonged to Army Sergeant John E. Hurlburt. Photojournalist Sean McKeever brings us to New Haven, where he was buried by family and friends. John Hurlburt, Sergeant in the U.S. Army. We are here to celebrate his homecoming and to honor him. An amazing day. Many years in the making um, through the United States Army. He's a soldier and true American hero. And he fought in, in one of the most fierce battles on the island of Saipan outside of Japan. I'm his niece, yeah, it's my mother's brother. And um, we never knew him. He, he died in uh, 1944. But my mother always talked about him constantly. I wouldn't have missed this. Even if I wasn't here playing taps for him, which is a tremendous honor, uh, I would be here anyway. God bless America for bringing their soldiers home. Amen. And um, my whole family is just so happy. My parents are buried right across the way, and it's just, it's just an amazing, an amazing thing that, that um, he's back here in America. And I said, Ma, he didn't march home, but he's home. And we're so grateful of that. <laughs> 